Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on some very common mental aviation calculations. In some cases, for example during an approach, it is useful to know the total track miles to touchdown in order to maintain at any moment the correct altitude and follow the predetermined flight path according to the descent planning. Fortunately, mileage of each leg segment is indicated on the arrival and approach charts, but with one common exception the DME arc mileage. So today I am going to show you how to calculate the length of the DME arc segment. In order to calculate the arc, we can either use different methods. First, geometry method. The geometry formula L equals theta times rho, where L is the length of the arc, theta is the angle and R the radius of the arc. Since theta in the formula is in radians, converted to degrees, the formula becomes L equal theta divided by 60 times rho. Second, the 160 rule. According to which, for a radius of 60 nautical miles and one degree angle, the arc length will also be one nautical mile. So, let's jump to an example. We have to fly across the specific DME arc the arc radius is 15 dme and the arc angle is 334 minus 234 so it's 100 degrees so the arc length will be l equal theta divided by 60 times rho will be 25 nautical miles if you found this video useful and want to see future videos please consider subscribing to the channel thanks for watching and have a happy day